But you know the 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 Bruce character? Oh, I don't know how I feel. I think like it's cool to have a character from Thailand, but at the same time, he just has the same moveset that Bruce has, right? Fuck you, man. He looks cool, but like it's just a bit confusing to me because he has like Bruce's moveset, but Josie's already in the game. That's my only confusion. Like I don't dislike him. I think he looks cool as hell. But it was funny when um he was so massive yeah. in the cutscene, and then he went like real small in the gameplay. <laughs> he's, he's like towers over Marduk in the gameplay. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I remember yeah. I didn't realize why it looked weird to me the first time I saw the trailer. The trailer I was watching the trailer. I was like, he looks really sick, and I was like, there's something about him that just. You know, like the Uncanny Valley okay, shit. Okay, oh, okay, okay, okay. Thank you, Brad, for six months of constant subscription to my Twitch channel. Oh, shit, guys, when you came into chat, I was gonna go, Oh, hello! Really loud, but I forgot. <laughs> <laughs> Dang it. Hey, dear. Brad. Oh, hello! <laughs> oh, hello! Um, did you have a good weekend, my man? Uh, yeah, so what I was gonna say is basically I'll do the tutorial because I've not I actually don't ha know how to play this game at all And whilst I'm doing the tutorial you can just talk to the chat and tell them why you like this game and you know What about you know the key elements that? Make it fun and stuff and then we can go into to Together and then we can just go through characters and stuff and you can just give like a little overview of the characters that you like And then we can actually just plug it into a game and you can teach me Green Ranger that sounds good. Sounds good. So I'll just start with this. So why do you like Power Rangers, Falcon? What is it about this game? I mean, Power Rangers was like the first thing I ever liked in my life. My mom was always telling me about like how when I was a baby, I used to go, power, power, and shit like that, watch Power Rangers. So I've, <laughs> I've always been like, um, I've always just been a huge Power Rangers fan, really. Like the, I also really liked the 2017 movie. I thought it was really good. Did you actually um, really like it? I thought it was. Yeah, no, I really liked it. I thought it was fine. They uh, spent too long in human form, yes, right? But like, um, but the thing is, they were they were setting up a lot for for the the next film, which is like the biggest part, right? So the, if they have another film, which I'm pretty sure they will, it's going to be godlike. And um, but either way, like I, I really liked Power Rangers, and I watched it up until like the I mean, like the mid 2000s ish, um, and then I kind of grew out of it, you know, but. I've always still liked it, and I've I've been reading the comics as well, like those DC comics, and it's always really cool. But the game itself, like more more on the game, it it's like Marvel, and I really like that. It's like Marvel that doesn't have a lot of uh, executional requirements. Like there's no there's no quarter circles, there's no half circles, no DP motions, none of that stuff. There's no like really really OTT things that you can do. But all of it's like timing based um, because the buttons are so easy. The timing on combos and like optimal combos is really strict, so I think that's really good because in in high pressure situations like where where you can find a hit, you really have to make it count because there's such a probability of it dropping just because you mess up one time. And um, I really like that to be honest. I think it, it set a nice little executional barrier without having the difficulty of the motions for some people. Okay. Um, yeah, because it's very much. I mean, if if you guys are watching in chat at the moment, you can see it's like do a special move, press X. And it's like they're all this, but there's three special moves, and they're all on just different directions and X rather than um, like like Falcon was saying, quarter circle forwards or whatever. So yeah, yeah, they're just no quarter circle forwards. You'll have like uh, back. Well, so people in this game they tend to use like the the anime fighter notations of like you know one to nine for the different directions. Um, but yeah, yeah. It, I mean, really, it is exactly like what Black Marvel said. It is kind of like Smash, where you have like special buttons, you know, like B buttons, and you have like directional B buttons. Um, all of the different specials with different characters have like different properties as well. You know, like what uh, James was just doing on the stream right there when he was push blocking the the What's super armor meter? attack. Uh, no, so the only thing is a cost meter are to snap back someone or to swap strike, which is what it's called in this game. Uh, where you just hard tag out another character and you force another character in so that costs a bar EX moves cost a bar and supers cost two bars Okay, but um, everything else is just free. I Think I'm pretty sure there's nothing else that costs any more meter, but um, Yeah, the game's really interesting because it has like a lot of Marvel-esque stuff But it isn't exactly the same like the combo system and the routes that you have to take are really different I'm still learning all that stuff myself um, because I've just been, I like, I freestyle combos a lot. Like, I figure out a route I can take and then I freestyle most of it, because 
you don't really know how you're going to open someone up in game, so you kind of need to make it work regardless. Um, um, but a <laughs> critical lack of gold ranger is like... I think, so, you know, in terms of the roster, right, I wish they had some other gens of Power Rangers, but, like, I can understand, like, they don't have the the the, the budget and the, and the manpower to do that kind of stuff just yet, but the characters they have added, I think that they've differentiated their playstyles so much, they all just feel, like, super unique and super fun to play. Um, so if you do have a character that you like, you probably would enjoy playing them. Um, but as far as, like, team compositions and stuff go... I think the best kind of team that you could have is to play a character that you really like, play a character that's strong, and then play a character whose playstyle you just gel with. And you'd have a really solid team. Like, it would just feel good. Or you could just pick three top tiers, but I don't even know what the tier list is like <laughs> in this game. <laughs> yeah, just pick three top tiers. There's only one... I've, um... I've seen, like, varying tier lists. I've seen, like, um, people put Gia Moran as the best character in the game, but I'm not even sure, like... I just think every character in this game, because because the health bars, right? Well, it's not the health bars that are small, it's the damage is a high, very high. So you can like in this game you can basically like touch a death someone off a single touch if you're if you're really good. Um But it's difficult. And it's bit, yeah, it's like what one tutorial. I she's like use a super attack and then she just stuffed me from doing it. <laughs> That's fuck? just Trini. That's just Trini for you, right? Yeah, I mean, for a budget game, it really is fantastic. Like, what well, Destiny is totally right on that. Um, the gameplay is just super smooth. Um, and I think every character in the game is, like, perfectly viable as well. I don't think there's any characters that suck. <clears throat> I mean, the, the, the roster at the moment, the, from what I can see, it's only the fact that there's... Um, uh, some characters just seem a little bit more complicated in terms of... Um, yeah, I love that. <laughs> it's so good. Even if you um you do the super and you cancel it, you reset practice mode. The the the, the sound still plays. Oh really? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's sick. Oh yeah. So, for those who don't know, I'm a Green Ranger fanboy. So, I've got to have two Green Rangers and then the Green Ranger Zord. So Green Ranger replaces X Factor in this game, really, doesn't it? It's like the comeback mechanic when you're down to. Oh, the the Dragon Zord or oh, the Megazords, yeah, yeah. The Megazords are like your your comeback factor. So when you're using your Megazord, you can press either one of the three face buttons, like one of the attack buttons, um, and it will it will call in like a different attack with the Megazord that comes in after a slight delay. Um, but all three of those buttons do something different, and they all do the same thing, so you won't have, like, random things that the Megazord will come down and do. Like, if you press square, it'll do the same thing that you do with the square. Um, but Megazords are just really good. They scale with so the time. The damage of the Megazord doesn't change. Like, X-Factor would increase your health regen and your damage and stuff, and Sparking and Dragon Ball also scales with the less characters you have. All it does in this game, from what I know, is it just changes the amount of time you could have the Megazord out. So... Obviously, if you have, you can only use it when you're at two characters, so one of your characters has to die. But if you're at one character, you're going to have the Megazord out for the longest time. Um, Cancelling into the Megazord thing, by the way, makes anything safe. You can instantly reduce the animation of, of anything that is potentially unsafe. Um, uh, it's just like an X-Factor cancel or a Spark cancel. Um, and yeah, so you can, you can actually use that to combo into it, but I haven't quite gotten that good yet. To do one. Oh, an arrow, this man. Why are you just. What the fuck is this character doing? Alright, fine. Yeah, I, don't... <laughs> I knew exactly what I was doing. Hey, didn't Crazy Game, are you good? Yeah, no, I was just figuring out those combos as I went along. Just Marvel combos, man. Alright, so that's it. Exit tutorial. Hey, didn't Crazy Game, man. Yeah, why are you playing Variation 3 Lair? What's the matter with you? The Great Bong Bao. Alright, so... No one's in game? Are you on? Uh, I am on. I'm just saying to the main menu now. It should say I'm in game. Maybe because I'm offline, hold on. Um... Hey, Forces! Emily, how you guys doing? Be... 
Power Ranger comics. No, the only Power Ranger comic I read was Power Rangers versus Justice League, which was sick. I'm just gonna restart my uh, game just in case. Um, there's a faster way to do your online status, by the way. If you hold your PlayStation button down, it's on the sidebar. Oh, Nanda Tour, man! You're teaching me all sorts of shit today. I, I got like, tech. What? <laughs> <laughs> right, let me What's restart up, this shit too. Just in case. Power Ranger comics are actually really good. I've been rereading them. Um, they're just really, really interesting. And I was watching a thing like with uh, Saban Entertainment, and they were talking about like people were asking him what they thought about the Shattered Grid comics as well. You know where they introduced Lord Dracon and yeah, they love it. They're like, yeah, it's not like obviously it's not a canon like continuation, but like if it's a fan thing, you know, we like it. You guys like it. What's the problem? Like it's cool. Bro. We like the fact that people are so passionate that they want to continue the Power Ranger storyline and develop their own stuff. Why not? Dude, I, when I saw Lord Draken, I was like, <gasps> an evil Green Ranger wearing the white and Green Ranger outfit? Honestly, if I was five, I would have done a literal backflip. <laughs> you, would have, you know the uh, you know the intro sequence to the parent the Mighty Morphin movie where they all just start doing front oh, flips. Oh yeah. Yeah, yeah, that would have been me. Yeah, definitely. That would have been you straight down like up and down <laughs> the stairs and around the house. You'd be cartwheeling and back flipping and stuff. <laughs> See, it's good. To, I mean, I remember there was a big period in like my early twenties, maybe mid, like late teens, early twenties, where I didn't didn't you to admit to liking stuff because everyone used to bury me if I was a comic book fan or whatever. But now as an adult, I'm like, everyone can do three. I'm going to watch it. If I like Power Rangers, if I like this, if I like that. And I like this chick. Ranger Slayer. Ranger Slayer. Yeah, so Cat has like, um, Cat's got a standing infinite. <laughs> I don't know how to do it, but... She's got some like crazy stuff. She has. She's a glass cannon character though. She's got like really, really low well, I health. I like her because I saw somebody playing her the other day, and she reminded me a lot of Taskmaster. I don't know why. Just the down arrows, and Taskmaster's my favorite <laughs> Marvel character. So I was like, yeah, there you go. I like Taskmaster. Oh fuck. Oh wait, what? Oh wait, hold on. Wait, 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 wait. Tell us about the Green Ranger. <laughs> we'll just talk okay. for now because you jumped straight. You were doing setups and shit, and I'm like. <laughs> just, well, I was just okay. square, like help me. So one one big thing to note when you're when you're playing against the Green Ranger or as the Green Ranger, see that move right there, mm -hmm. that two L, that low light, that's not a low. Oh really? And you can stand block this, yeah. Oh shit. But two M is a low, and that's your sweep. So because that that sweeps you, it knocks you airborne. I can launch you off that. Oh. Um, but Tommy is pretty good in the sense that he's different from Red, where he can just launch you anyway with down heavy. Um, but Tommy's like all about cancelling things into different things. Like he has back special, which is his ground shatter. It has OTG properties on it too, but you can cancel it into 6S as well, and then cancel that to air Ooh, nice. Okay. Um, and Tommy in general, like the way I play him is I just try and play him with my assists to cover my backup and my gaps. So if I do this on someone, I'm not going to do that because it's unsafe and full combo punishable. But I will do it if I have a Goldar assist coming in to back me up. Because yeah. then if you try and press a button or try and punish me, the Goldar assist is going to hit you and I'm going to full combo you. Okay. So um, why did you pick Green Ranger? What is that about? Because because Tommy is my favorite. Okay, <laughs> right, yeah, I'm, I'm going to be switching to White Ranger when the skin is out. Uh, okay. Because uh, I prefer White Ranger a little bit to Green, but I do really like Green. Um, <laughs> You're wrong. <coughs> Sorry, I just got a cough. <laughs> and, uh, <laughs> and Lord Zed's my favorite bad guy. And, um... Yeah, so, just the, but the fact of the matter is that, like, not only do I love Tommy, they made him so fun to play. He's His cool. combos are sick. Like, he just does a bunch of cool stuff. He's got a multi-hitting projectile as well that keeps uh, people airborne he's with just neutral He's got Andy's dive kick from KOF. But yeah, he's got um, his air M. You can do a second one as well. He's got like a unique air auto combo with his medium. Oh, really? Um, That's cool. His jump heavy is really good. That has like crazy cross up properties on it, even in the corner. Um, 2M is a really good footsie tool. 5M, 5H is a, just a good whiff punisher. And he's got like, you can delay heavy auto combos and stuff to just stagger. Um, but most of the time, yeah, it's Tommy's just mobile and he he does a lot of damage. So if I can find a way to open someone up, I can always like clean them out. All right, so kill um, this woman and then show me a BNB. All right, let's hope I don't drop it. Blood 
bloody hell, man. Firstly, that was sick, and it's not finished it, is it? Oh, I missed the ending, but the ending over there, I could have done that into Lord Zed Assist and the EX, but, uh, yeah. So that, that's that pretty much like, comic combos are like that, and, um, I don't, I, this is the route I made up. Like, I, I made this combo, and I find it really fun to do. I stole the loop concept from someone else with the, uh, the, the two reps of the loop with the, with the fireball in the corner, because I realized that worked, and I was like, wait, I can do that after an OTG, sick! So how do you, <laughs> so how does the combo, how, what is the combo mechanic in this? Because you were doing, I don't know how many OTGs and more bounces. Yeah, there. see, I don't, I don't actually know. I just oh. kind of learned it by feel. <laughs> I don't know what the, rec what, the, what the limitations are. I know you can't do like multiple ground bounces okay. and stuff, but you just get used to it. Um, okay. let, me, let me see if I can find something in the Discord, because I think someone actually did put the exact amount of stuff that you could uh, do in. Because and when I'm watching they, people's combos, they're doing like the same string on somebody eight times, then launching. Yeah, yeah, I'm, that's what confuses me. Okay, so apparently this is the this is the formula. So in the air, three so you can get three crouching lights, one ground bounce, one wall bounce, three spin knockdowns, two launchers, one stagger, and one crumple. Assists, ex, and supers aren't limited. Okay. Uh, according to that's according to the Discord. So I don't know if that uh, information is totally accurate now with 1.6 because it's slightly outdated. But um, oh, I think most of it kind of runs similar in that respect. Okay. Also, yeah, if we don't hit rematch, it'll just boot me out. So like, at least at least it's showing you. Hold on, direct challenge. You're too slow. Do you want me to join yours, or do you want no, to join mine? Otherwise, we're gonna get stuck in the vortex and just sitting there. Yeah. Like... <laughs> no. It's like when you, it's like you know when you're wa someone's walking the opposite way and you both turn left, you oh, both yeah. turn like right. <laughs> oh no, hold on. I think it's, I think it has done it. Hold on. You need, to, I think you send, send me another invite. All right. Oh wait, hold on. Oh no, wait, don't. No wait, you send me. Oh, it's, <laughs> I do, do it. Do it. So I'm just gonna go through the roster. So basically, just keep picking different characters and going through what it is about them you like and blah blah blah. So yeah, find team. the unique properties of their attacks more than anything. Like Cat, her Air S, which is the dive kick, that has OTG properties. So like, it's really important to kind of like go into practice mode and just figure out what kind of properties your characters have because the resources online aren't the best. Like, it is kind of a poverty game. No, but like, it's it really um, isn't, man. I, do you know how many people I actually went into a? A lot of them are outdated though because of 1.6. Um, the 1.6 update changed a lot of the combo mechanics. Um. Well, that's and... how I got into the Discord, was because I actually just, I was like, F this. I just waited until somebody, because nobody streams it either. I just went into the, this guy's stream. I can't remember his name, but he was a really safe dude. Hey, dear Monster Panda. Um, yeah, I just went into the guy's stream, and I was like, guys, how the hell do I learn this game? And then they were like, well, these are all the resources. But there's no, like guides anywhere or yeah i mean that's what i meant like the discord is the best place for to, to actually learn if not like twitter videos um so yeah switch to zed show us some zed all right well lord zed is apparently regarded as one of the worst characters in the game but like i don't really agree with that i think it's just because he's unsafe in a lot of stuff but if he if you have him with assist he's pretty good he's got hella good footsies like his 2m like covers that much range he reminds me a little and... bit of this lml from um Soft yeah, kind of. It's like a side yeah. character that can pull you in and... Kind of reminds me of a testament. But, yes, um... yeah, yeah, testament too, yeah. Oh, one, so second, like, one, second, one second, wait, quit, sorry. Look how sick Lord Draken looks, by the way, look. Look at me with my fucking Green Ranger flute sword and the White Ranger sword, and I'm a mixture of both. Just how sick. Look, and I've got all the weapons on display as well. Fool! I am dead! Like... <laughs> when I want your opinion, I'll give it to you. <laughs> Remember when he invades the command center and he throws them all into turmoil. <laughs> I love him. But yeah, go on. Sorry, talk about Zed. Um, so yeah, he's got he's got a command normal with forward heavy, which is no red. Fucking hell. Um, <laughs> uh, it's it's unsafe as shit, oh, but okay. like that's why you want to use it from the furthest range. Um, his his forward dash and his back dash go through people. He's got bison stash basically. Oh shit. Uh, but his walk speed is also akin to Bison, like, it's a hell of slow. So, with his combos, most of the time you won't see people dashing unless they do a mid-screen combo and knock you further towards the corner, because then they have to dash close to distance. Medium auto combo is a natural launcher, like that. Um, and overall, like, he's got really good buttons, like, his footsies are really good, that's his 5H. He's got, like, 5 heavy heavy, um, he can start cancelling things. 
into like I'll show you some some little Z stuff like. And the parties are so cool. Oh, and then into. Oops. Oh, did you not mean to tag? Uh, I meant to do the assist, but I press it one more time. Um, but yeah, it's it's basically like that. So after you do like the the crouching medium, it's the heavy heavy. On the third hit of the heavy, because there's four hits in total, on the third hit you can cancel it into the forward special where the putty comes out, and then you get a free medium auto <laughs> combo. <laughs> Fucking putties. Um, and also Zed is like one of the coolest supers in the game. Thank you for the six months, my man. Ultra, ultra, six beautiful months. Thank you so much, my dude. How's your weekend, brother? I hope everybody's enjoying the stream. Monster Panda, how you doing? Ultra, ultra. Goldar, on the other hand, just don't get hit by Goldar. Show me Goldar, show me Goldar. <laughs> oh, God. All right, so, so Goldar... When the game first came out, he actually had an infinite as well. Goldar is fucked. Um, <laughs> I picked him up because I love Goldar, <laughs> but then I realized how strong he was, and I was like, oh my god, I'm never changing him. Um, fire a projectile at me. Uh, I think you can do it with standing medium. Alright, do it again. Do it again. Oh. It's hard to react to it online, but like, yeah. The with with slower projectiles He's it's much easier. Like, Chrysalids move. He can literally yeah just reflect projectiles at you. It doesn't do any damage except for your projectile, but like, um, he's also got aerial flight cancels like that. Flat. What? <laughs> yeah. So basically, you can mix, and then if you if you catch someone and then you confirm it, bruh. <laughs> yeah, dude, show me show me show me a gold art combo. Basically, right. we're gonna go through the whole cast, like, well, all the cards that you know roughly how to play, like Kruger, Trey, Dracon, and then we'll just and then we'll just start playing. Yeah, so my my knowledge of Trey is like super limited, like, because I want to try and learn him a lot more. Um, he's a character I'll brush over, but I do play Cinezoic Blue in my main team. Hey, Buana, how you doing, my man? Oh shit, sorry, Pets. Yeah, Gold Ranger's Trey. Yeah. Uh, all right, Gold Dark Combo. And you invent all you do that. You, you can do that you. into um. So because Cat's got a small, uh, no, not Cat. Uh, because Kim's got a small hurt box, it's, it sometimes fucks up. But after the second heavy, you can do a super if they if they switch sides. Uh, but it's important to delay the the auto combo afterwards. So like when you get the air grab, you do the second heavy over there, and then you ex, and then you can super off that and basically Why kill someone. Why did that do ninety five percent? That didn't even look. That complicated compared to like. Yep. <laughs> Did you see that? <laughs> oh my god, that's that is some anime <laughs> shit. Yep. Wee. <laughs> um. <laughs> gonna try dash. Wee. How did so win the green? Going back to Green Ranger briefly, you comboed all three of his special moves together. Yeah. So I just did a uh, back special into forward special into air special. Oh. But there's there's a timing after you do the bounce off them. So, when you recover from that bounce, you can press air special, and then you'll dive straight down. Which, it feels a bit natural for me, because I played Nova in Marvel 3, and his air S was basically like the same thing. Oh, Nick, Nick was a Nova player in the last one. Hell you, yeah. You weren't doing any of the, like... Like that sort of stuff. You were just, you were just combo no. straight into special moves. Yeah, so that's just like a specific combo I found. Most of the time I'll do like, uh... If I'm going to convert something like that, I'll just do something like this. Ah, uh, okay. How did but, you do that um, axe kick? The... Uh, oh, oh, back, back medium. Two. Yeah, that's an OTG. Uh, it's also an overhead. How do Second you know when it moves a hard knockdown that you can OTG off? I think it's the way that their legs move. So if I do... Uh, see that? Okay, so you see them slide a little bit and their, their legs go up. And then I could do that. Do, do, like, do, do, do. You can always, you can always um, finish a combo with Green Ranger in standing medium, forward medium, and then off the forward medium, you can always do a super. So, you know, so long as the, the combo doesn't have like too, too many hits in it, then you should be able to just do like medium, forward medium into super. And those two will combo together. Okay. Um, but, <laughs> yeah. Got him. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. No. Oh, oh shit. What does the- oh wait, what? Wait, wait, what does that Z do? The big Z? It just- 
Projectiles. Ah, oh, okay. Uh, but if you hit him, then they go away. Just like that. Um, also, if a character is airborne, and they're bouncing, they're airborne in general, if you press a light, it'll automatically flip them out. So you have to go into mediums or heavies. Ah. Oh. But mediums and heavies chain together anyway, so it's not too bad. Is that a low as well? That looks like a Tommy low. Uh, it might not be. Let me try some. No. Yeah, no, it's not. But her 2M is a slide. Ah, oh, okay. Uh, so what you can do with, with Kimberly is, when you hit the slide, after the heavy, you can, after the slide, do a standing heavy heavy into a forward special, then that will pick them up and then you can cancel that. So you want to get two hits of that auto combo because the time's going to run out. But you can get two hits of that auto combo into forward special for like a rising knee, and then you press triangle to just get the uh the diagonal shot and then she can continue the combo from there you just go back into the crouching light crouching medium standing heavy forward special okay and yada 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 so you're just making the shit up as you go along you haven't really looked at a lot of i've looked at combos and stuff but i'm still trying to figure it all out like most of the stuff uh has just been through freestyling and figuring out ways because i don't know like the touch of deaths on every character or like all the time so most of the time, like what I just tend to do is, um, I will just make up my own thing using some things that they have done, and then just find a way to open someone up and have to constantly open someone up, so that if I'm not killing someone off one touch, I'm killing someone off like a guaranteed two touches, you know. Okay. Um, in this game, is a bit casual or execution heavy for sure. Goldar. I mean, no character in the game is specifically, like, really hard to play, except, like, I think I'll only say, like, two characters, which are Ruger Trey, and Quantum. Trey yeah. and Anubis. Oh, yeah, yeah, Quantum as well, Quantum, yeah, three. So, fuck me, Eric is hard to play, man. <laughs> he's, <laughs> he's, he's, he's difficult. He's so cool, but, like... Um, yeah, it's definitely more casual than um, execution-heavy, because all the special moves are done. So, like, you, each character has three special moves, and it's done with... Um, just pressing the buttons, just pressing yeah. X. It's like, it's like neutral thunder. specials and back specials. Yeah, it is exactly like Rising Thunder. Um, but that's pretty much the the gist of it. Most of the rest of it just comes down to how you play the match and then how much you can try and get off your off your combos. You know, because if you can't kill someone with a combo, you want to try and find a situation where you can then mix someone so that you can open them up again and then kill them. Man, I'll tell you what, one thing about this game that's super fun, which you've touched on, just coming up with the combos, like, just then I saw, so I ended a combo with this, and there you go, that's the setup that you and have. Then, yeah, exactly, it gives you setup potential. Now press, uh, press standard special, this neutral special, and now do the air S. Uh, oh, so that's what, so this combo... Yeah, it you... amplifies all of your, all of your, uh, individual things. I, I think it amplifies your medium shots as well, your arrow shots. Oh, I won. Ha <laughs> ha, you suck. I've only played wow, this game for like 20 minutes. I'm actually free. <laughs> oh, wow, she holds her... Uh... Alright, so let's go to... Let's try some different characters. Because I want to see... Kruger looked fucking sick, but he looked a bit mental. Like he's doing some Kruger anime. is hard as hell to play. Like his, I... his timing is just really tight. If I, if I was good at this game... Oh. I'll give you a rundown hey. on these characters. Thank Who else was it? It was Trey. Have you tried any season ten of uh, of LOL yet? Like properly, sixty eight bits. Dang! Thank you, bro. Ooh, the silver looks clean. I need more quantum power. I like this. The look of this guy. Is, oh, this is a James, definitely a James character. Random. Oh, you have to pick. Okay, so apparently this game is region locked, but you can still do uh, direct matches regardless of region. Oh, really? That's cool. See, I'm, that's one of my my New Year's resolution before even New Year starts is to just play more fighting games rather than just Mortal Kombat. As much as I love Mortal Kombat, and it'll probably still be the focus of this channel. There's so many games out there that deserve a little bit of exposure. Yeah, man, I want to run this game at Red Bull. Not gonna lie. Um, so Anubis doesn't have like a. He's got to run, like, but he also has like a wave dash. So you can dash manually by pressing L and M. 
but you can also just cancel forward dashes with crouch or back. So you can basically just like Korean forward dash lol. <laughs> Um, Anubis is 2L is also, it's a mid. <gasps> Wait, he's got- but, Yeah, he's got- he's got Johnny attacks. Yay! Oh, that's why you said Johnny! Yeah. Look. Slash! Slash, slash! Slash, slash! And he's got Captain Commando! Mm-hmm. The oh. Captain Corridor, he's got the- the- the freaking launcher over there. Um, but the thing about Anubis, right? As you see, when he's in this stance, he can do different things. He can forward dash out of this stance and then do that for an OTG. He can slash with light. He can do the launcher with medium. He can do the captain commando with uh, heavy. Captain commando! Um, and his standing L is a low. Oh, so it is a low. So, Does he have yeah, it, that, it's, it's a low. His medium is a really, really good button. The, the standing medium. Really good with Punisher. So is the standing oh, heavy. Bloody hell. Um, I need more quantum power. But Anubis is mostly just like... Because in this stance, you can cancel that stance like that. Whoop. By pressing special again. Oh. But it makes things interesting because you can do stuff like this. Oh, he's fucking sick. See? Man, am I going to have to learn this fucking... Ugh, gosh darn it. <laughs> hey Josh, Leroy's out! Ooh, guess what I'll be playing later. But is frame data out yet? Or is it just Leroy? Tomorrow I'll be playing some Tekken with Combat League, I think. He's so sick. Yeah, um, his forward special is a parry. Um, but yeah, like... Anubis is really, really cool. He's just really, like strict on, on his timing. You have to really be on point if you want to hit those cancel combos. Um, Eric, oh, so Trey? With Trey, I don't really know too much about him. I know that his crouching medium is an OTG. Um, and he has loops. Because I know Clockwork, the, the striker oh, yeah, player yeah, yeah. from Marvel, he plays Trey. And Trey's got, like, hella good mobility and, like, really good buttons. Like, that, that jumping medium is a really good air to air. But he can, he can just loop you. Yeah, he and I, I don't really know how to do the loops properly, but like if I were to guesstimate it, it would be something something like that, and to yada yada yada. But he can keep doing it. Um, it's just pretty difficult to do. Quantum is like, let's see, he's just I don't even know. I'm I'm still trying to figure him out. <laughs> so he obviously got all the stuff from like the first time the Quantum Ranger actually appeared in Time Force, right? When Eric actually started fighting the first thing, he could do like his his gunshots and stuff, but um, he can like. Do the low stance as well, and then you can teleport out the low stance. That is so mad. Yeah, <laughs> um, one of the guys I play with, Jack Spratt, he actually plays Quantum Ranger, and he's got a pretty good one. He plays Quantum Gem Scott and like someone else. I need but more. it's nice to out. see because uh, he's also got sword loops. <laughs> Funnily enough, being Virgil, like <laughs> yeah, 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 <laughs> yeah. When he sword. puts on quantum quantum power. Yeah, I need more quantum power. <laughs> that's the thing is that what I was watching with Quantum Ranger was that he has like 50 hit gun combos and then he switches into his sword and then the combos carry and then he on. Loops with you, sword. Right? <laughs> yeah, I'm just like fucking hell, yeah. this combo's gone on for days. Uh, do you mind if I try to get this Anubis combo yeah, on yeah, you? I want to see if I can land it. It's really hard to do though. Should I move right, walk for it just a tiny bit. Let me get in the corner. Oh, sorry. All right. Ah, oh, shit. Instead to like, five it. Uh, 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 uh. I can restand. Like... Yeah, yeah, I saw that was a restand. Anubis is sick. He's sick. He's just so hard to play. <laughs> That's it. But do you think, uh, like, relatively... You know when you say hard to play, do you think relatively, like... If you play... Not to, not to belittle this game at all, but hard to play, do you think that means, like, takes a long time to learn? Or do you think it just means, like after a, a few, like a week or so, you'll have it down. I think after a week or so, you'd have it down. It's Honestly, it's just timing, because you don't have to worry about the, the directional input. You don't have to worry about dropping, like, um, one of the buttons. You just have to worry about the time that you're pressing stuff at. So, like, just think of it like Street Fighter 4 links, just easier button requirements. Um, you just need to make sure the timing is on point. Uh, but there are like simple combo routes you can take. Some characters are more strict, like Anubis is more strict if you want to get the proper damaging stuff. Um, but with people like Sino Blue and with um, 
Green Ranger, it's not too, too important. You can kind of just get the hang of it. Slash, slash. And then you you can you can cancel that second slash with you have to you have to like triple tap S because oh, really? you have to go back into the stance and then you have to cancel the stance and then you have to forward dash into medium. <laughs> he's, he's wild. He seems really sick. Yeah, I want to honestly. I'm just looking forward to like any really really solid Anubis players I can watch. Oh, he's me, so cool. Let me let me kill you and then we'll switch to another character. Sure. Um. Have you, have you tried any Drake on that? Because I know you wanted to learn him to help me. Uh, so my only, the only bits I found with Draken are like, I obviously just started playing him in the beginning anyway because he's taught me just evil. Um, <laughs> yeah, yeah, there you go. But I haven't found too much with him. I know, I only know like probably stuff you already know where he can do like his forward special to dash, and then you can cancel that into like, he's got air special to to fast fall. His, I think. His the second hit of his of his standing heavy is an overhead, but I'm not too sure. Okay. I feel like I have a clip by it when I'm crouch blocking, and it does look like an overhead, but I'm not 100 percent sure on that. Uh, um, the dragon kind of follows the similar combo systems as some of the other characters do. Hello, Sunjula. Do you play this game? Anybody that plays this game in chat and has any advice for us, please let us know because we're just a lot. We're making this shit up as we go along for the most part. Uh, show us, show us Cenozoic Blue as well. I'll be two pinks and a green. Yeah, Josh is a Tekken God Prime or whatever it's called in Tekken. I'm a new brother. Jesus. Yeah, did, jo Jordan and Josh are both really good at Tekken. Oh, but I just can't wait to learn it now that the frame date is in it. Rather than just having to, I mean, it, it's yeah. always been in it, obviously, but but yeah. So talk about so this is movie Power Ranger Blue, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. This is from the 2017 movie. Um, so with Sino Blue, he's got like a charge up state, right? But before I get into that, his forward special without the state does this, and you can you can repeatedly mash it. So it's, it's honestly just a pretty good spacing tool. Um, when he has one level of the state, like he has right here with the sparky hands, hmm. he can do fireballs, oh, uh, he can do like double traps on the floor, he can air teleport. Um, with two levels of it, he gets that, which is the ultimate fuck neutral move. <laughs> so just try, try and walk into me or something or press buttons. Oh, I messed up, sorry, sorry. I accidentally was holding back. Um, alright. Come in now. Oh, so it's like sand, sand trap neutral tool. Yeah, except it hits everywhere on the screen. Uh, it's like Magneto's <laughs> So if you're pressing something and not blocking, fuck neutral. Like... <laughs> See, what's your... See, but okay. he can only do that when he has two powered up states. Um, I wish he was like this in the... In the movie, that'd make it. That'd have been so sick. Imagine if they just all started teleporting around and shooting Hadouken. I know, right? Just imagine if they were mixing you, like. <laughs> um, yeah. yeah. So Cena Blue is he kind of just like follows a lot of the same combo routes as as I do with Tommy. I haven't his optimal stuff is super like weird to me right now. I'm still figuring it all out, but I'm really confident I can find a hit with him, which is the important part because I really like his playstyle. So. If I can like find a hit with him, then I'll just go into like pretty bog standard combo. I'll do that. I'll get like a hard knockdown, and then I'll just go into like setups uh... and I convert them. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much it. You can disrespect his air teleport, by the way. Oh really? Um, if you just hold down and press buttons when I teleport. Hold on. Do it again. Oh, cool. Um, but yeah, so like, don't let me get away with that if I just do it raw, but usually I'll, I'll do something like that. Which is, which is really dirty. Um, because the, the Goldar shoulder also has a lot of blocks on it, <laughs> so... Oh, really? Yeah. Like, shell shoulder. Yeah, yeah, pretty much. Moves that are unsafe on block and full combo punishable with loads of blocks done. Haha, <laughs> just my character. <laughs> um, so wait, so if, if for air combos, what's the best route to do if you want to do an air loop? So if you want to do like, you know how you were doing like, delayed it slightly and then doing... 
Like outside um, of the So mix. when I do like, I'll relaunch you, right? Or something, and then I will just like go light, medium, and then I'll end in like a standing button, like a standing medium into something else. So like, light, medium, medium, forward, uh, medium, okay. back, medium, medium, forward, medium, super. Like that. And then over here. how you, you the background go. changes for the level three when. Yeah, when you're in the command nice. center. It's, That's <laughs> wicked. But you can't cancel those moves on whiff. So you can't cancel the ground shatter on whiff. Oh, really? They have to at least block it. Oh, easy news. Who has the swag? Sundula? Uh, probably Blue Ranger. He's got um, some stylish ass combos, but um, like combos you can just juggle people into double shock setups into like the OTG with the fuck neutral move. It's sick. <laughs> it's just really hard to do. Uh, is there, <laughs> right, is there any other that. characters that you want to show us? What about the the dragon armored um, this chick, Trini? Trini, oh god, no. Trini is like my most hated character in this game. She is literally just. Her. No, I don't play her. Lammy oh. plays her. And uh, every single time his Trini just tilts me somehow <laughs> because she's just annoying she's got super armor on like uh, so much and she's got like fucking jump range 50 50s it's like go away what, you, did you uh, she's not hard to i don't find her hard to beat it's more that she's just irritating to fight against but i don't play her myself so i don't actually know like her buttons and all that stuff what about um i saw you play udona did i make that up these udona? are no no that's lammy that plays udona see i play cool characters <laughs> right, I'm just picking three random characters then, we can just have a look at them. I'll show you some other characters I messed around with a little bit. Oh yeah, the Red Ranger seems really cool as well, he's got blaster loops. Oh hell ranger. yeah, the Red Ranger is sick! <laughs> <laughs> no, no sand traps, Nace. I wish. Watch me play Tekken, I don't have sand traps in Tekken. Or do Imagine one. if Tekken did have Garrus. <laughs> well, he got Akuma. Just, uh, it's not yeah, he's the new character, they're just like... <laughs> Instead of, uh, no, 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 not instead of, the last character that's gonna come out, they're just gonna have, like, Kronika come out and be like, Good egg! And then Garrus is like, yes! I wish, <laughs> I really hope that they make, um, oh! Okay, so I just froze you. What does this do? Yeah, neutral special is her, her freeze. I imagine having to deal with Scrub Zero in this game as well. Uh, okay, show me Red Ranger. He's like uh, the Ryu, right? The basic... Uh, I, I don't think so. I, I think, like, he has some generic stuff, but, like, a lot of this stuff is, like, really, really cool, to be honest. I think he's cooler than the Shoto types. Oh, go and show um, me, show me. Back roll. He's got back roll. Um, which is just back special. But you can you can double tap it, and then he'll fire, like, his guns. That's sick. Uh, he's got air gun, which has, like, little to no recovery on it. Um, that's, that's the loops, isn't it? Air loops. It's yeah. Like um, but his heavy is a really good range. He can get combos off like his heavy, heavy auto combos and stuff as well. Uh, but yeah, so like I think it's like yeah, it's stuff like that. But like his neutral special is super armor on it, and it leaves you in a crumple state. So I won't show you there because you don't obviously die. But like <laughs> it leaves you in a crumple state where you can like fully combo off that, you know. Um. Four special OTGs, and you can also do it multiple times. Which is, um, is that a record, or is it you press it once and he does it three times? No, you, I press it three times. Oh, okay. So you can press it once, you can press it twice. Um, but three it, it OTGs. Oh. <laughs> three times, Jason. <laughs> uh, Magnet Defender has just crap tons of super armor and parries. He seems like a James. Oh! Um. I play mess around yeah. with this woman, she seems pretty fun. Gia, yeah. People regard- so uh, there's one person apparently that's like ranked 1 and he regards Gia as the best character. But I don't know about that. So that's like the kind of combo I would do with Kim. Oh nice. Is like the- and you do that. But so you, you can- you can get follow-ups. Into the forward special. Yeah, the standing heavy, you want to get two hits of it into the forward special, and then on the second rep, you get one hit of the standing heavy into the forward special. Okay. But, yeah, Kim is uh, interesting. She's got really good mobility and stuff. But, Jen hits a lot of times, but she kind of does follow a lot of similar, like, generic combo routes. 
Um, but yeah, the the person I was telling you about, he also plays Gen, plays Quantum and Gen, and um, it's sick to be honest. Show me Gen. Show me Gen. Oh wait. Oh, okay. Let me show you. Oh, my Gen is like trash, but I will show you her. Yeah, show me Gen, and then we'll just get in some games, and then you can zip me up for. Yes. Hey, hello, Todd. I, do, I, as I was just saying to the rest of the chat, firstly, how you, how you doing? Secondly, I was just saying, yeah, you know, just want to play some more fighting games. Just get some more, some more love out there. The uh, the Red Ranger assist also OTGs because it's his forward special. Oh really? So you got yeah, it's, it's a really good assist. Uh, Trey assist, you can use that like Yamcha assist. <laughs> it's so annoying. I haven't played Dragon Ball Fighters in so long. Yeah, I haven't played it in a long time as well. This is sort of like more fun, if it makes sense. No, I, I, I'm not gonna lie, I find this more fun. Oh shit! Look, they're fighting background. Closer to Marvel, yeah, it's sick, isn't it? <laughs> um, what Jen, it Jen has like really good range. Like her, her mediums, her, her five, her standing medium and her crouching medium are really good. Standing heavy hits, but you see how everything just kind of hits a few times. Yeah, it means that like when I'm comboing with Jen, like it's a bit confusing to me because I, I don't really know when, <laughs> when I'm meant to be cancelling. <laughs> yeah. So I think you can do like. <laughs> but she has an air dash. Uh, anime. Bloody oh, hell. Stuff like launch that. Me. She doesn't look like she does tons of damage though, but I imagine those moves blow through super armor. Uh, the thing is I don't actually know her combo. She does hurt quite a lot. Because she can combo into like, she actually gets a cinematic super as well. And she's got hidden missiles. Holy shit, that did a lot of damage. Wait, what? Ah, wait, what? Why did that super take off half my life? Is the super just do a lot of damage? Yeah. Bloody hell, man. That just did 50%. Yep. That's just how it be. Okay, let's play. Uh, just right. kill me, actually, because you're much... I'll see if I can... Uh... Oh, I meant to Why is that weird? Uh, I don't really know Eric Combos. Yeah. He, he's so cool, but I don't know how to play him. I wish I could. <laughs> When's the new character supposed to come out? I think the middle of this month. Oh, okay. So... That's gonna be Dai Shi from <laughs> Jungle Fury, I think? I don't know, I didn't watch Jungle Fury, but I've looked up the character and he looks sick. There's been? a lot. There's a lot. I'm, I'm honestly waiting for a character Turbo. Oh, you say Turbo, <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I've just got a lot of attachment to the Turbo. It was my favorite movie out of all, as well. But the the Mighty Morphin Power Rangers movie is still godlike. With Ivan Ooze. Ivan Ooze would be cool. Imagine if they did Ivan Ooze. Um, Imagine. No, actually, hold on. I love Turbo. It was so bad, but the thing is, like, at the time when you're a kid, you don't even care about that. I just saw cars, cool helmets. Tommy Oliver being the Red Ranger, um, and cool cars, <laughs> cool intro. Alright, so basically the next hour or so is going to be me getting absolutely pieced. It might be hell. Uh oh. Where's my breakaway? Uh oh. Yep. <laughs> Oh, happy birthday! Yeah, this woman doesn't seem like a James character. <laughs> I'm, uh, trying, I'm trying to anti her, and I still got hit. <laughs> <laughs> Oops, and I tagged out. Just, just so Dracon could get zipped. Whoa.
Oh, pfft. Oh, I forgot you push block. Oh. What are these setups? Oh. Where? Uh. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> what the f- <laughs> Was that come on, Graham? <laughs> It was um. So the first one was a normal throw into the the back special anti air grab. <laughs> My down one down one optimals, yeah. <laughs> 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 Look, I'm a Sindel main now, bro. You can't hate me for that. Don't even get me started on that nation. That was messy. Maybe we will switch to Tekken sooner rather than later because I can't <laughs> I'm getting absolutely starched. Uh. There was only one character they could have revealed yesterday that made me want to drop uh, Kazumi, but they didn't. So, I guess I'm still Kazumi player. Who was the... Kunimitsu. Ah, uh, I used to play Kunimitsu. She was my uh, Kunimitsu character. was sick. I don't super with blue after knockdown because I just can't be bothered. I normally would if I want to kill a character, I will, but I'm just playing against James who like doesn't play right now. <laughs> <laughs> just started. <laughs> Where are the optimals? Oh. Oh, bloody hell, those tick throws are dirty. Uh, uh, uh. Oh, bloody hell. Yeah. Oh, I missed it. Yeah, take my mega combo. I wish his, uh, his air S, like, actually gave you the, you know, like, properties like Novos would. That'd be cool. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. How'd you throw again? Uh, two plus four. Oh. Goldar is here to be a uh, Goldar is here to be a bitch. Jumping light. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> Jumping light. <laughs> Am I dead? Holy shit. Well. Goldar hurts. <laughs> I'm pretty sure I can kill off it, I just don't even know. I don't know how to how to change it yet. <laughs> I've only had this game for like a week now. It's fun as fuck though. It's so much fun. Alright, we'll do a couple more and then we'll, we'll put some more combat or something on because this is... Until I learn how to play, this is literally you just beating up a baby seal. Basically, yeah. The The whole point is just to help you learn so that you can come back stronger and then destroy me. <laughs> it's like an anime! But that's, yep. you know what, that that's a key, what we're in. That's a key element of fighting games in general, is you need rivals. You need somebody you know that will get better if you beat them and not give up. Do you know what I mean? Mm. Well, Kid Lammy is honestly, he, he uh, we play each other a lot and it doesn't go too well for him, but he just constantly has the motivation to just keep playing me. And I like that. Because I'm learning it too, like... I just want people to play, you know? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> My Green Ranger assist <laughs> fucked me up. <laughs> I was expecting it to hit up. <laughs> no. No. Oh, what? Keep your, keep your shit. <laughs> no, you, I want you to have it. It's my gift. It's Christmas. Um, oh. um, I don't celebrate Christmas. Oh, okay. no. 
Taking you to anti Santa land. All right, let's no. go. Uh oh. Bloody Nora, man. Oh! That combo didn't even look like... Oh, fudge, I didn't realise what side I was coming in on. Nice. Oh. See ya! I like him because he's got Wesker moves. You know what really ruins here of uh, Wesker is Quantum Ranger's teleported stuff out of his gun stance? Yeah, yeah. Back to you. Uh, but yeah, I, I definitely think that like the years I played like Marvel 1 and then like Marvel 3, I didn't play it as much 2. I really liked 2, but I didn't oh, bro, like... I rinsed 2. 2, I, I rinsed really into the ground. But I, um, I think at that time I was playing like CVS 2. Um, but... Marvel 1 I played so much in like a local arcade to my house in New Jersey and then um, Marvel 3 I banged that game out <laughs> so hard like that game was so much fun But never to this day I still can't play Dante properly Dan The one character I, I wanted to like learn and perfect I couldn't learn him <laughs> but Dante in that game was easily one of the hardest characters to they made it a little bit easier but it's, it's just like all the bold cancelling in there, like. <laughs> yeah. Oh. Yeah, I love the sound effects. Do 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 do. Haha, <laughs> dropped the combo because I died, noob. <laughs> oh no, I tried to push luck early. See ya. Oh, you killed Tommy, nice. How do you learn the frame data in this game? Is there. Ooh, I don't. Nice I, just, I just kind of. Uh... Learn what's punishable, what's not punishable. Ouch. Well, that's cool, aren't you? Oh. If I press any one of the heavy buttons with Lord Z, by the way, it's uh, kind of punishable. Unless I have an assist with me. He seems so sick. He is. Uh oh, that's hitting me. Oh, the light! That's fucking good! It <laughs> just slipped straight <laughs> over me. I keep forgetting about. Oh, never mind. I'm hella dead. So, ladies and gentlemen, that's Power Rangers. Uh... <laughs> go, 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 Laura Rangers. Go, go, in my asshole. Oh, oh man. 18 plus stream now. Sorry? What? <laughs> <laughs> what did you say? <laughs> I said this is an 18 plus stream now. Yeah, tell me about it. Um, is that the play... last one you wanted? Yeah, I was going to say, do you want to play some MK? Yeah, can do.